Troy, it's Crane. Crane? You're alive. Troy, Jade... Jade's dead. Oh. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm really sorry, Crane. I, I mean it. What happened? Rise. He... He forced us. Jade saved my life, Troy. Again. She died... saving me. Crane, you've still got to call off the Ministry. That's why Jade sacrificed herself. So you could do this. So you could save the rest of us. Is Savvy there? Has he figured out how to get a message through? Yes, but to do it, you need to meet me. I have to give you an amplifier that Savvy says can help us break through the signal jamming. I'll wait for you in the safe zone. Halfway to the antenna, what you'll need to mount the amp. Okay, Troy. On my way. <clears throat> Dr. Camden, it's Crane. Do you copy? Crane. Good to hear you're still alive. Did you find Jade? Yeah, yeah. I, I found her. Listen, I also found Dr. Zara's tissue samples, and I'll bring them to you, but first there's something else I need to do. I know, Doc, but I'm about to buy us time. I'll be in touch. Great. Here's the app. So, what do I have to do? You need to install it at the highest place possible. That way we'll have the best chance to break through. Okay, so let me guess. I need to head out to that giant antenna tower at the edge of town? The fastest way is through the sewers. Savvy will guide you over the radio. So contact him when you get to the other side. And Crane, when you install the amp, make sure to set the correct frequency on your radio. Pull this off, and the entire world will hear you. Let's hope so. See you, Troy. Beautiful weather. Oh, this must be the place. One day I'm gonna do this and end up landing on a bag of rusty knives, I just know it. Hey, Savvy, you there? Uh, yeah, man. You okay? I'm above ground and still in one piece. Oh, good. Now listen, you'll need the key card to the substation. Otherwise, there'll be no power to the antenna. Okay, where do I get this card? You'll have to search the containers. It'll be in one of them. Would I have to search the place? You mean the card might not even be here? No, no, it's it's there, mate. It's just the last guy who tried to do something like this made it to one of the containers before we uh, lost contact with him. Yes, fucking finally. Got it. Savvy, I got the key card. Great. Now go to the substation. It's close to the antenna mast, inside the fence. Use the card to get inside. Exploding <laughs> one's fucking perfect. Savvy, I'm in. Okay, good. Turn on the transformer.
this into a powerhouse. Yeah. Just get to the top. No sweat. It waits till I'm all the way up here to stop raining. Anyone who can hear me, please listen. My name is Kyle Crane, and I'm sending this message from inside the Huron Quarantine. Colonel Tanner and the Ministry of Defense have lied to you. There are still survivors inside the walls. They plan to firebomb Haran, but if those bombs drop, you will know Tanner and the Ministry are cold-blooded murderers. Holy shit, there's someone alive in the quarantine zone? Hey, do you copy? Do you copy? It's Aldrin! I knew it! <sighs> that was too close. What the hell do you want? We want to offer you a chance to get out of that horrible place. Oh yeah? And why would you do that? I never found out who had your precious file. You don't even have to pay the rest of my fee. Water under the bridge, Kyle. We're best off just to move past that. All you need to do is to bring Dr. Zara's research with you, and we'll send a nice, safe helicopter to extract you. You realize I know what was in the file. I knew you were going to exploit the virus. Crane! Oh my god. You need the cure now for spin, don't you? That's the only way you could get out of this! Try to convince everyone you were working toward a cure the whole time! Don't be ridiculous. Bring us the research and everything will be fine. When you want the research? Just fucking wait for my signal. Savvy, you there? The amplifier's installed. Brilliant, Crane. Now just zip line down. That tunnel I mentioned is near where you land. No, no, no! <gasps> yes! Dr. Camden, this is Kyle Crane. Can you hear me? I can hear you. Are you on your way? I'm ready to work. Just bring me the samples. That's exactly what I intend to do, Doc. Just remember, I'm surrounded by an army of infected. Affirmative. Expect me soon. Good. Not like I'm going anywhere. me. Name's Crane. Use the elevator. Push the button for the bottom floor. Got it.
sad to hear about Dr. Zara. He and I were thrilled to get the chance to study the Haran virus. And not to mention, the GRE paid us quite handsomely. Oh, by the way, we're on backup power now, so we have minimal functionality. I needed extra power for my last experiment, and the generators overheated and shut down. Was enough. Good job. All right, now head back to the decontamination room. You know, I suspect even if Sarah had been able to leave the quarantine, he wouldn't have. He and the operative both felt the need to stay and help people.
Finally shaking hands with you. Now, let's have those tissue samples, shall we? Hey, Doc, you mind if I show you a photo? No, 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 just, just, just one minute. Take quite a while. Now, what uh, what was it you wanted to say? Hey, that's him. That, that that's the GRE operative I was telling you about. What's his name? Amir. Yes, yes, Amir Goreshi. What are you doing with a picture of him? We uh we had a mutual friend. The samples are still viable. That's good. With some luck, your trip here won't have been for nothing. Uh, where's the rest of the data, by the way? I know Zara prepared two packages. Yeah, I'll have to get back to you on that, Doc. Right now I have some GRE shitheads to confront. GRE? Crane, you watch yourself around them. Their public face is a lie of epic proportions. Those people are all heartless, lying bastards. I hear you, Doc. And thanks. I'll be in touch. Listen, Crane, I gotta reiterate. You better watch your back, your front, and both sides with those GRE bastards. They'll screw you if they get the chance. I know, Doc. I'll be careful. I just need to figure out where things stand. Hey, Troy. I give the samples to Dr. Camden. Now I'm gonna go have a little talk with the GRE. And what are you going to tell them? Everything. I'll meet you later, Troy. This is Crane, do you copy? Kyle Crane, you can hear me, can you not? Rise. Where are you? Exactly where I should be, atop my own tower. Of course, mine is not quite complete, but... It still stands as a monument to chaos. To entropy. To what it means to be ruled only by oneself. I'll kill you for what you did to Jade. For everything, I'll fucking kill you! I had hoped that would be your attitude. You see, we are at war, you and I. A war of opposing philosophies. A war to see whose vision of the world proves true. Come, Crane. Come and challenge me. What is it you Americans are so fond of saying? I dare you. You know what? Forget it. There is no war. There's only your fucked up outlook. Go to hell. Oh, no, no, no. I won't be going to hell. I will be leaving Narando, you see. I have made a deal with our GRE brothers, using your very own communicator, no less. They know I have all of Dr. Zera's research data. They call it the keys to the kingdom. Very shortly, a helicopter will come and take me away. Imagine the damage I shall be able to do outside the confines of these walls. Of course, if you think you can stop me. You crazy son of a bitch! That is what I had hoped to hear. Come and find me, Crane. Let us finish what we began.